welcome to my channel. My name is Shauna, and with, the, with me, I have my princess doll, Ariel, from The Little Mermaid. She was my Valentine's Day gift this year from my husband. And if you haven't seen, I do have a box opening and review video for her already. And I have another video where I changed her outfit a few times. Those are both available to watch if you wanted to see more on Ariel. I know when the new dolls come out, it's sometimes it's more fun to like see all the videos that are out there on them. So um, when I got her, I kept saying, um, I'm sorry about that. When I got her, I placed the order because my husband said, you know, pick out the princess you want. And this was the one I wanted. And when I placed the order, it was going to cost me money to get shipping. But if I placed a little bit more in the order, I could get the shipping for free. So instead of putting money towards shipping, and I did have her rewards. Um, oh my gosh, why am I saying up? Instead of putting money towards shipping, I put the money towards another outfit and used my rewards. So the outfit, the, the, both out, the doll and the outfit came separately. I completely forgot about the outfit. Here is the outfit. I got the birthstone collection. And this is uh, Alexandrite, I think is how they say it. Is that it? I'm not really into, I'm not really familiar with birthstones except for mine. It's just not my thing, but I love the birthstone outfit collection. But this outfit, I guess, showed up on Saturday. Today is Tuesday. No, it's already Wednesday. And we have the kind of thing where if you get a package, the mail girl, it's a lady, she puts it in the box, the mailbox with a key. And so it's been sitting there since Saturday with a key in my own mailbox. And I didn't know, I think the rain has kept me from checking the mail. It just occurred to me last night as I was falling asleep, like, oh my gosh, whatever happened with that outfit? Did it ever show up? Because I think it was due for the 20th, and that's what made me think of it. Yesterday was the 20th, but it actually came on the 17th. So I'm going to open this up, show you the outfit, and I'm going to dress Ariel in it. I think she will be the perfect doll to wear this. I think Ariel, she's looked beautiful in so many different outfits. And purple is a color I know I will love her to wear. I've already seen her in soft purple. This is a deep purple. And right now she is wearing a something navy mix and match. Look how cute this one is. It looks really good on her. I didn't think she would look so great in this dark navy blue, but she does. So I'm gonna get this outfit out, put it on Ariel and show you and let me know what you think of her redress. And I know some people really enjoy putting her in the Disney themed outfits, but I didn't buy any of those yet. I will do plan to buy them eventually. Right now I'm enjoying seeing her in outfits that we don't have the catalog or like the American Girl pictures already done really nicely to show us. I want to see what she looks like in other outfits. So I'm waiting on that and I'm also trying to spend my money on other things that will probably be gone before the outfits. And I know the outfits, you know, can be on back order and there already is one already. But I can Now before I put this on Ariel, I did want to show you the outfit. So there is the overskirt, kind of is like tulle and um, they're, okay, it's not strips, it's like pleated different colors, I wasn't sure exactly, uh, but it looks like it's strips. Uh, this little one piece jumper has like a taffeta feel, and I'm sure it's nicer than it feels, but um, sometimes taffeta feels nice and sometimes it just feels kind of thin, it just kind of feels, it's the thinner of the two taffetas. And the shoes are really cute, in a way they remind me of bowling shoes, I think it's the colors, or I mean the, the way the tongue is a different color. But these have these fancy jewels, which are really cool. A couple of like colored rhinestones and then kind of pearls. The little choker necklace that closes in the back with Velcro. And of course the cute hat. And I'm looking forward to putting it on Ariel. Okay, everyone. What do you think about Ariel in this outfit? For me, it's one of those outfits that I'm like, oh my gosh, I love it on her. I just love that hair of hers, the gorgeous wig that she has with this deep purple. I think she was, she can just live in this outfit, although she won't because I love changing my dolls as you've seen. For me, the, the most fun part about dolls is dressing them and I love looking at other accounts and seeing other people's ideas and YouTube channels. I think it's so much fun that we all, some things like are very similar and we might have like a really close to the same things, like ideas and thoughts. And sometimes I'll look at an account and be like, oh my gosh, it's exactly my thought. And then sometimes we'll look at an account and be like, oh, I didn't think of that. What a wonderful idea. I think Ariel looks stunning in this. I did take her necklace off um, because of the choker little ribbon. 
and I want her to be able to wear it. She doesn't have a doll stand right now, so hopefully she doesn't fall. I was nervous about not doing the doll stand, but with this Velcro, it's not Velcro, I'm sorry, it's elastic waistband, it was kind of gonna be messed up with the doll stand. If I was gonna store in this outfit, I would use the doll stand, because things fall in my house. Um, I have a cat, two cats, and my dogs bump into things, I bump into things. It's just not safe to leave things without, any dolls without a doll stand. And I do wanna mention though, this outfit, as much as I love it, I did not like putting it on because of these um, the little cuffs on the sleeves were tight going over the thumbs. And at first it reminded me of when I try on a different brand that isn't made for the American Girl doll hands. And I thought, oh my gosh, am I gonna have to call American Girl because I can't get this over her thumbs. But it did go on, but I don't like when fabric is like that because it may eventually um, tear. It's not good to have that when you have to fight it to get it on to your doll. So that is just something, hopefully it was just the angle I put the outfit on and it's nothing more. It'll come off easier and go back on, you know, easier the next time. But I did want to mention that. So I really hope you enjoyed this video. I know it's not very long. Um, I do have more outfits from the birthstone collection. I have a whole video, if you haven't seen it, of the first five that I bought back in, I think it was November, September, I'm not sure. Um, but I also have that video. And then since then, I think three others came to my house, which I didn't get a chance to make that video because Christmas and you know how stuff is, you get busy and so those are still waiting. But in the meantime, this one came and I thought I have to make this video. So there will be a, col it's not complete yet. I think I'm still missing three outfits, but I will be doing another video because I know these outfits aren't other people's favorites, but they are some of my favorite outfits by American Girl because it's just so much fun to dress my dolls and things I would never wear but I do love these outfits. They're so much fun. And I meant to feel, okay, this is kind of rough and I'm not quite sure what kind of fabric it is, but hopefully you notice it has sparkles. Um, sometimes behind the display stuff, like I've seen this in person, I couldn't pick up on some of the details that I'm seeing once it's in my, <laughs> in person, not behind glass, display glass, I can see it. So let me know what you think. Um, and I hope you're enjoying this video. If you do like what I share on my, my YouTube channel, um, check out my Instagram account, Sofer Dolls, and hit the subscribe button, please. And I have playlists available for our generation, for Barbie, for Reborns, for um, American Girl Doll stores. I have a playlist, and I have like American Girl Dolls and American Girl box openings to name a few of my playlists. So I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you again, and as always, keep enjoying your dolls. Bye bye.